everyone. Um, this is Boat Back for some Ghosts and Goblins fun. I um, want to thank Paul Kitching uh, for posting the solution to our problem. Um, we couldn't play this when we were doing the live stream yesterday. And the reason why was because the... Uh, just adjust this camera real quick. Um, the reason why is because we didn't have the RAM set correctly. Um, we put... <laughs> epic intro there. Um, let's see. I've got to figure out how to enable joystick control. Um... Okay, so, Ghosts and Goblins, here we go again. So already I like this more than Ghouls and Ghosts. Uh, up to jump, still in a wing, but definitely not the worst thing in the world. Um, the music is great. So anyway, what I was saying earlier is that we had the wrong RAM settings. Um, this game, I guess, works if you kind of emulate what was going on in a uh, 500, so 512 chip RAM, 512 slow RAM. Once I did that, and uh, it fired right up. So Now, if I was going to play this seriously, the first thing that I'd do, and this is what I told Aaron on the podcast, and he did not believe me, but it's true. You start out randomly with either the fire or the spike, the lance, um, just like the, the Nintendo version. Uh, the fire is not nearly as good. People will tell you that. They say if you get the fire, just restart. We're not restarting. We're soldiering on here. Oh, I was hoping that shield would somehow protect me in some way. Oh, man. You know, you might as well die when you lose your, uh, your thing that early. It's not even worth it. Like to know what these things do. I'm sure the manual would tell me. Boy, I am. I'm terrible. I've got one life to live, and then we'll go back to the, the title screen, and hopefully I'll I'll get the uh, the lance. And that will be better off for me. There's the lance. Come on. Yeah, all right. I feel like I might be able to make some progress here. I'm going to take the low road. Oh. These things are vicious. Don't worry. Just keep trucking. <clears throat> I'm guessing there's not a save state. A save state. start with the lance this time, which is helpful. Oh, run right away, run, right, yep. Okay. Oh, 
But there's no question that this game is superior to Ghouls and Ghosts. Uh, they did it right. Yeah, I don't want that fire. <clears throat> what I want to do is... <sighs> not that. Come on. Oh, that was a, was a lucky break there. All right, all right, all right. There's some money. Little demon guy. What's up, demon guy? All right, I'm dead. I did get an extra life, though. For whatever it's worth. Mm-hmm. Yeah, starting now with the fire is just a drag. That's what we need. Oop. Nope. Yeah, you really have to take that upper that upper route. Um did get, I wonder if I could, I oh, can't use the keyboard. Um, mortalize there. Yeah. Um, I'm just wondering if the, uh, this is a this is a cheat or this is a cracked copy, but I don't they didn't put the the trainer on the main menu. But that's okay. I feel like you've kind of got an idea of the difference between ghosts and goblins and ghouls and ghosts. Uh, Aaron should be posting his own playthrough on the real twelve hundred of ghosts and goblins too, so you'll get to see his perspective. Um, so anyway, we'll see you next time. Adios.